two greatest detectives on this Valentine Detective Agency radio about there was an emergency. So me and Nick are here. Uh, and since this is a new area, like uh, going out of the role playing thing, I want to show you guys. I'm only bringing the Silver Shroud's new signature weapon, the Spray and Pray. And I only am wearing what I was wearing. I got my patrolman, goggles, and then I have the mysterious serum because I don't want to anger the psychic guy because he told me not to store it anywhere. Plus it's really helpful against radiation. And since the area we might be going to, there's rumors that there's a lot of radiation. So, you know, and then I got my rat axe, my rat away, and my stem backs. I even put most of my misc stuff away except for like you know the keys and things but all my junk my mods then i got just my ammo but i figured i want to go in like you know kind of blank uh so all the stuff that we'll be getting will be from there so if you see it in the inventory i'm glad you're here from the new DLC. we got a new case while you and nick were out ready to put on the detective hat oh yeah tell me more our client is a fisherman who lives on the edge of the Commonwealth, Kenji Nakano. Nakano? Huh. That name takes me back. Hmm. My memory's a little fuzzy on the details, though. Maybe if you bothered writing things down, Nick. Can't do that. Wouldn't want to put you out of a job. Huh. I'll remember that the next time you need me to console a hysterical client. Mr. Nakano didn't leave many details. Said he'd go over everything when you meet him. But if you want my guess, missing person case. Guy had a worried look a mile long. Well, you know how it is. Anything Kenji you can Nakano. tell me about Kenji Nakano? Just he sounds like the samurai guy from Fallout He was Fallout obviously 3. upset, but he was also in a hurry. Like, he couldn't stand just waiting around. I'm a friend of Nick's. He'll remember me. I need his help right away. And then he was gone. He was muttering something on the way out, but... No. I'm not sure it was important. Come on, Ellie. Tell me. Tell the Silver say? Shroud. Well, I thought I heard him say something about a daughter and also a radio, but I might have misheard him. Not sure how the two would be connected. I'll go check it out. What if his daughter That's is a radio? The Nakano residence <gasps> is up in the northeast. Plot near the twist. Coast, a small fishing house. He said that he and his wife will be waiting for you. It's a long walk. <laughs> That's how the hard cases always start. Long lonesome road. Eh. DLC from another game. Well, see, Nick, you obviously have not been traveling with the Silver Shroud long enough to realize that I have magical teleporting abilities that can get me pretty close, like right to the insane asylum. Though the time it would take to walk is still the same. Don't question the magic, Nick. Don't question it. Sometimes I imagine when we fast travel, we're just telling the person like, oh, we need to go there. And then we fall asleep from their consciousness. Like we become their subconscious while they're traveling. And then when they get there, we become their conscious again. They're like, boom, possess their body. wants to face the shroud so I'll try not to pick up anything unless it's a un unique new um, DLC one until we actually get to the island but this will be the silver shroud journeys to Far Harbor and I'm so hoping there's some really cool armor and weapons the Silver Shroud needs new gear to test out on his enemies. Plus, I'm making the Silver Shroud like a Batman type. Gah! That's right. Mud crabs, get him! Ah, Manta Man's on my side, bitch! Manta Man's on my side! These are his minions. Oh! That's that's because I stole the last piece of pizza in the unstoppable headquarters. All 
right. Uh, so like this, I won't pick this up, but take the ammo. But I'm not gonna take anything else. Just mainly because I want specifically to get only like you know the new stuff to show you guys. I might come back. I'm never coming back, but I might. You know, after I'm done with Fall Harbor, they reget that, but. I'm not too worried about it right now. Um, I mainly want to show you guys the new enemies and the new armor because some of it is really awesome. And you guys are awesome, so I figured I would introduce two awesome things together. How the fuck do I get up here? Uh, Sir Kenji. So Kenji, I've I've come I've come to help. What do you mean I can't go that way? Look. Look, calm down game. Calm down. I'm I know what I'm doing. I'm the silver shroud. Try look, that's that's foreshadowing. It's like you're gonna die. You're just a lonely level 35. You're never gonna make it. And then, you know what I tell them? I put speakers right by their ears and I blare, you're gonna go far, kid. Really loud. But it's in reference to me, not them. Which doesn't make sense, but who cares? I'm insane. <gasps> oh, this house is so nice. Oh. Damn it! Oh, Come you want to join my settlement? I know you're listening on the other end. Where is she? Where is my daughter? Kenji, please. Where is She's my daughter? Stop. You need sleep. She's out there. Someone has her. Raiders or gunners or God knows what else. It's the Institute. I haven't destroyed them yet. Hello. Hello, Kenji. You let ourselves in. I, well, I let myself in. I don't know what, what he was doing. You need to get to work right away. She could be hurt. She could be... Whoa, whoa, slow down. Uh, Kenji, was it? Why did you go over the details with me and my partner here? You have to get to work right away. Detectives. So, what's the story with you and Nick? Nick didn't tell you? Ran with him on one of his cases a few years back. Searching for some sort of lost heirloom. He needed a boat. Things didn't end well. We were double-crossed by the client once we had what he was looking for. I still have some lead lodged into my hip. Yeah, right. Yeah, it's starting to come back to me. Sorry, things ended sour. We got out. That's all that mattered. And now you can return the favor by finding my daughter. I'm here always to here to help. Tell us what happened. I'm it's so all trapped. This damn radio. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. This world's greatest the radio detective. Was her latest project. Until she made contact Batman with some ain't got shit on me. who lured her away from us. Or maybe she left on her own. She's not a child anymore. Our daughter is 19. She knows how to survive and she's capable. I... Do I... Do I sense a new companion? maybe she left because she wanted her own life. No. She would have do, told us where she was going. Do, she would have do I sense a samurai something. companion? I know my daughter is in danger. I can mm -hmm. feel it. Mm -hmm. Anybody? Find her, please. Samurai fisherman companion? I'm not gonna ask for we'll my... Because I'm the silver shroud, bitch! <laughs> Thank you. Who needs bottle caps when I can murder criminals that steal their bottle caps? I mean, about her. seek Just out justice. Don't worry, Kenji. We'll get to the bottom of this. Yeah, we got Just this. Just sit tight. Question, Ken. Oh, all right. Oh, Mrs. I'm, Nikon. I'm gonna get all detective I here. You have questions about my daughter. Ah, uh, radio. More about this radio your daughter was working on. I remember Kasumi was very excited about it. I figured she was secretly trying to make contact with Diamond City or another settlement. We're pretty isolated out here. She only has us for company, and Kenji can be overprotective. She could have gotten. Contact I'd with like my people. We are everywhere now. Like shine a light on where she's going. My Almost everywhere. Strong, focused, careful. A little bit of places. That's but... how I know she's still alive. But why would she leave without telling us? 
Maybe we... No, never mind. I don't want to waste your time. Every detail is important, Mrs. Nakano. Every detail? It's just that we've been fighting a lot more. All of us. Ever since Kasumi's grandfather passed away, he was the only one that could really talk to her. Kenji and I don't understand machines, but those two could work together for hours. I... She started staying in her grandfather's boathouse late into the night. Huh. I thought she was just trying to cope with the loss, but now I wonder what she was up to. You and your husband don't seem to agree about why your daughter left. We both want to find her. The world out there isn't a place where you want to be alone. But Kenji still sees her swaddled in diapers. Nobody knows about... He doesn't about see a young woman with her own decisions to make. Maybe about what a daughter would do other than a mother. She wasn't tricked into leaving without telling us. That was her choice. She didn't want us to follow. Why? Every detail is important, oh, Mrs. Nakano. It's uh -huh. he was the only. She uh -huh. Every detail uh -huh. is important, Mrs. Nakano. It's just mm -hmm. he was the only. Silver Shroud, stop! Staying. We don't. We, we know this. I have a horrible memory, Silver Shroud. Uh, we were injected with radiation Mr. going Nakano. into the Did you have the radiation sea. About my daughter. Oh wait, that's all the same. No more questions right now. Work quickly. I wanted to check it out at least for you guys to make, make sure, you know, I wasn't missing anything. Any important details? If I do miss anything, feel free to leave a comment saying how I'm stupid. And then I will just reply back, 13 Bravo, huh? Okay. Ooh, what's this? I'm gonna touch things, alright. Uh, this belongs to me. Look, first DLC wrench, guys. We're we're going places. Grandfather's note. Dear, my dear Kasumi, if you ever get locked out of the safe, then the answer is here in the boathouse. Picture where the key is. Oh, a riddle! Looks like we're fighting our own Riddler, guys. All right, uh, give me the key. Oh. Now, let's see what's in that safe. The grandfather's the new Riddler. The Riddler of the Silver Shroud. Project log? Why would she, um, wait, why would myself. she put her own note? I never really thought It's just about the tester who, parents. Uh, what I am, but, God, where do I start? The radio. I was right about the range. I managed to get a signal, a strong signal from up north. There's a group of people up there. They say they're all synths. Synthetic people. Made by the Institute. Oh, they're trying to build a place for their kind. Where they can be themselves and be accepted for what they are alongside human beings. It sounds wonderful, but... Sounds like cryons. They started the asking or... about me, and some questions came up. Questions I don't have answers to. I mean... I've always felt off, like I'm not really supposed to be here, but then there are things in my childhood I can't remember, and I I've been having strange things. dreams. I, I'm going to go to meet these synths. I, I have to know the truth about myself. They what do you told think, me to sail up north to a town called Far Harbor. I can make my way to them from there. Daughter takes off by boat, but more importantly, there's a colony of synths up near this far harbor. Exactly. We need a way to get there. Let's go talk to Kenjin. He knows the water better than anyone. All right, guys, and I will let off there. We're about to run out of time, but tune in next time to see if the Silver Shroud and his faithful companion, the Inspector. Oh, I changed the gender. It's like, oh, see if they can actually save the daughter. If she even needs saving. Tune in next time. Same Shroud time on the same Shroud channel.